what I want for you to do first of all is to take your thumbs and your index fingers and I want you to circle them in a rhythmic mirrored motion. Having your hands on a desk, if you're, if you're watching this, if you can have this on a desk, is even better. Because I, I would love for your hands to be in your eye line. At the, and if you can, and I'm not going to widen them too much so you can still see my hands, but on the periphery of your vision, even better. And you'll, you'll get why it's shortly. But for the, for the time being, I want you to have them up at kind of eye level if you can. Circling, circling, circling. It's already making me yawn. This is how... Wow, this is how my system has learnt what this does for me. And this is true for anything, you know, the more you do it, the more you create a neurological shortcut. So it's like carving a new pathway through the woods. You know, it's a little bit, it takes a bit longer to begin with, and then the more you do it, the quicker it gets. And for me, I've been doing this so often that I very, very quickly go into that zoned out space and start yawning. My whole system just learns. And this is going to flip you into rest rest and digest state, the parasympathetic nervous system or the parachute system, as I like to think about it. So so you've got your thumb and your index finger circling, circling. Now, I want you to become aware of the rhythm that I'm inducing. It's about once every lazy second, like this is important. So we just circle the thumb and the index finger with that rhythm. Keep that going on autopilot. That's really good if you're doing that. Already, that's already beneficial, by the way, because you're using both sides of the brain at the same time in a rhythmical way, and it's actually really, really good for you. Then I want you to relax your jaw at the hinge by softening it. And I want you to w imagine that you're warming and softening the hinge of the jaw so much that it opens like this. That hinge opening is a turnkey to relaxation. However, if you induce it from the hinge rather than just forcing your jaw open, the effect will be even more lovely. So I want you to warm the jaw at the hinge, soften it like softening butter, and allow the mouth to open, the jaw to open. That's right. As you're doing that now, I want you to defocus the eyes. You'll still hear the words that I, stay, that I, that I say. They'll go with you, guiding you. I want you to defocus the eyes and become aware of the periphery of your vision. Become aware of the outer edges of the vision with the relaxed, open jaw. And you may notice your index fingers and your thumbs equally, both circling, positioning your hands right on the periphery of your vision. And it's easier with defocused eyes and a relaxed jaw to notice the very, very outer edges of your vision. That's right. And I want you to close your eyes and become aware of the amount of space inside of your mind. That's right. And I want you to imagine that you're walking on a beautiful, warm, sandy beach. And as you're walking forwards in this beautiful space, allow the warmth of the sand to emanate through the soles of your feet. Feeling that warmth as you are now remembering that warmth, warming and relaxing you. Notice the blues of the sky, hear the sound of the waves, the sound of the sea, the salt in the air, the breath and the support of all the space around you that is yours. 
and I want you to count out loud 1 to 15 as I'm going to with you now as you're walking forwards on the beach. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. And now I want you as you're walking forwards to count backwards from 10 all the way down to zero as you're walking forwards now. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and one. And I want you to hum a tune with your eyes still closed, the relaxed jaw, the periphery of your vision, and the awareness wide with those fingers and thumbs circling. I want you to hum a tune, hum it out loud. Great for the brain, do it now. I want any old thing, just a mm, humming, not singing, so no words, just the humming. Mm, and just hum, hum, hum. Just humming for a while. You're doing really great. Now I want you to imagine that you're drawing with your feet as you're walking a figure of eight. I want you to do four figures of eight, walking in real time in a figure of eight, just turning and crossing and then doing the other part of that figure of eight. Do four laps, counting out loud as you imagine you're walking it in real time. One. Two, three, which is so good for the brain. It's great for flexibility. Four. And do two laps in the opposite direction. So imagine you're turning and walking in the opposite direction. One. And two. And when you're ready, keep circling the fingers, open your eyes. Just blink a few times, relax the fingers down. And if you have some water, I recommend it's quite nice to have a drink of water after doing that. And notice how you feel. <laughs>